this movie actually makes you feel sorry for food. Sausage Party, directed by Conrad Moron and Greg Tiriff, and tells the story of food living in a grocery store that are alive and but see humans as gods and believe whenever humans uh, pick them from the grocery store they have been chosen to go to a better place, the promised land. But of course, we all know what really happens. They are brought home and get brutally murdered and eaten alive by us. So it's up to Seth Rogen's character, the, the sausage and his buddies, to uh, t warn the other food at the grocery store about uh, the threat of the humans. Now I had mixed feelings about anticipating sausage party. I mean, it looked weird as hell. It looked a com like a completely fucked up film, but at the same time, it did look original and. Uh, inventive and fun and that's something I always appreciate about a movie, originality. And so I went into it with an open mind and I have to say I liked it, it's pretty good. I mean this uh, for one thing is, it might be an animated movie but it's uh, one of the few animated movies to actually get a theatrical release to be rated R, kind of like Batman the Killing Joke as well but this is not a kids film by any means. It is full of uh, sexual innuendos, uh, swearing and adult humour full out. So do not bring your kids to see this, you will scar them for life. But because the humour is aimed at me, I chuckled a few times. I I was having a good time. <laughs> yeah, and, and Seth Rogen did a pretty good voice acting job, as he did with Mantis in, in Kung Fu Panda 3 earlier this year. And yeah, the... And, uh, and the... And his girlfriend, uh, the the bun, uh, she she was all right. Uh, her character design was a bit weird and a bit a bit freaky, but she was all right. Uh, and like I said, the film is creative, original, and uh, imaginative. Uh, I uh, I applaud them for making an uh, animated movie for adults that shows how diverse animation can be. It's not just for the kids, and and the fact that this film actually uh, makes you uh, gives food character and makes you sympathize with food is uh, something that's never been done before you really it makes you hungry seeing all this food but at the same time it makes you think oh shit I just I just murdered that poor food it really makes you care about uh, these these foods from the grocery store that you buy uh, they made uh, our home to them look like hell kind of like they made Sunnyside Daycare uh, look like hell and Toy Story 3. So, in fact, this movie's kind of Toy Story with food, but anyway. And the finale of this movie, it's crazy. It is so fun. And uh, you will not believe it. <laughs> it it's really unexpected. It's, it's, but uh, as much as I liked Sausage Party, I can't deny... It's not a great film, nor is it one of the best animated movies of the year. I mean, as as a, as original and as fun as its story and characters are, the animation is not good. The animation is so uh, mediocre and an average. I mean, they put little to no effort into it whatsoever. Even, and even the human. Uh, character designs look terrible. Granted, the animations are better than Food Fight, whatever that piece of shit was, but uh, that's uh, not saying much. And uh, the as much as I liked Seth Rogen's character and his girlfriend, uh, some of the other supporting cast uh, in the movie they were pretty forgettable. I still cared when. When they got murdered and, and eaten, but uh, I really would have liked to, to have remembered them a bit more. So, overall, uh, Sausage Party, it's a good film, it's fun, it's uh, and original, uh, weird but original. And I also forgot to mention that it does touch on some religious subjects, which is good that they touch on such uh, 
uh, mature themes like that. So Sausage Palsy, it's a, a solid effort. So it, it won't be for everyone, uh, but it's still uh, worth your time. I give Sausage Palsy three and a half stars out of five. And I think Alan Menken scored this movie. You wouldn't expect Alan Menken to compose a soundtrack for a Seth Rogen comedy. So, one well, of the weirdest movies I've ever seen, but not a bad thing. So, Sausage Party, guys. Thank you all for watching. Have you seen it? And what did you think? Please comment and let me know. Please like this video and subscribe. Please follow me on Twitter and on my Google+. And I'll see you all next time.